InMed Awards. This is our opportunity to both recognize people who have been serving humanity, the forgotten, the undereducated, the refugee, the non-English speaker, the disabled, the elderly, the veteran, and also to celebrate people who have been providing essential care on their behalf, people whom you can follow. This year's International Medicine Award recipient is Jeff Collier, a plastic surgeon and the 37th governor of Kansas. Dr. Collier's work has been both executive and front lines. As a White House fellow, he worked in agriculture in relations with Russia. And then in 1986, he began volunteering with the International Medical Corps, providing medical care in conflict zones of Kosovo, of Rwanda, and of Afghanistan. Dr. Collier trained Afghan medics during that particular war in the 1980s. Next up, we have the 2020 National Healthcare Service Award. This year's recipient is Glenn Talboy, a professor at the University of Missouri, Kansas City, and the director of surgery at Truman Medical Center. Dr. Talboy, for decades, has been providing surgical care for low-income residents of the Kansas City metro area. Not only this, but he's been training his young surgery residents with this kind of skill and this heart of compassion for the needy in Kansas City. He has also been a sponsor of the Humanitarian Health Conference now going on for eight years. The 2020 Cross-Cultural Leadership Award recipient is Kimberly Connolly. She began her career studying international relations and French and teaching English as a second language. Since 2013, Kimberly has been the director of the Office of International Programs at KU Medical Center. She oversees international scholars and learners coming to KU to share their skills, as well as KU learners and scholars serving abroad, most significantly in the University of Gulu in Uganda and also at Christian Medical Center and College in Volor, southern India. We have the 2020 International Healthcare Preceptor Award. This is an award we give for people who are showing others how to do care for the forgotten. This year's recipient is Gatham Desai, a professor of community medicine and family medicine at Kansas City University. He's also a leader of DO Care, a global organization providing medical care for people who are living in low-income communities of India, of Southeast Asia and of Central America since 2010, and he has been taking his students to serve people in Guatemala where they not only learn the nuances of disease, but also how to see it expressed in his own values and compassion. We have the 2020 Humanitarian Crisis Response Award. This is an award we give to people who are leading efforts to respond to disasters and concerns around the globe. This year's recipient is Charles Mboraboon. He did an International Medicine Fellowship at the University of Rochester and also was a Fulbright Scholar focused on emergency care in Southeast Asia. Today, he's the director of the Global Learning Track at Truman Medical Center's Emergency Medicine Residency, where he not only trains his own United States residents in these skills, but also travels to the nations of Laos and Thailand to help them develop their own emergency response capability. The 2020 Common Ellis Award for Compassionate Care to Humanity is James Fife. James is a native of Lee Summit, Missouri, he began his uh, adult life as a youth pastor in Central America. After several years in that role, he went to nursing school at St. Luke's College of Health Sciences and then did a master's degree in nursing education. At the Humanitarian Health Conference seven years ago, he met personnel from Bach Christian Hospital in the mountains of Pakistan. In 2015, he, his wife Rosie, and their three children moved to Pakistan and for the next four years, not only provided nursing care for ill Pakistanis, but also taught in the nursing school of Bach Christian Hospital, equipping Pakistanis with these kind of skills and values necessary to care for their own people. And here we have the 2020 InMed Award recipients. <laughs>